Well, here is a great chance for you to add a pet to your forever home. Joining us now is Jennifer Shakirky from the Columbia County Humane Society to introduce us to BB. And BB's wearing her little Halloween garb. Look at her. She's just a baby. She's ready to go trick or treating tonight. Yes, she <laughs> is. She's adorable. Now she's a Chihuahua. Yes. How she's... about how old? She is about nine months old. Oh, she's still, she's still a baby. Yeah, she's still still working on her people skills. She's pretty shy. Yeah, but I mean that doesn't mean yeah. she's mean or you know nip no. you know nip 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 to people. No, 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 no. She You're definitely not nippy. she definitely wants to be around people. She just she just shakes. Well, I mean so. it's going to take a while. She's still a baby, and let's mm -hmm. not forget. You know, she's now in a shelter, so this is not exactly the yeah. ideal environment, but I always say the lucky ones make it to shelters. So, uh, what does someone need to know when they uh, adopt a little chihuahua like BB? Um, just kind of take your time. They're smaller, so you're going to want to watch your step. <laughs> they can get really shy around kids, loud noises. <laughs> so maybe uh, <laughs> somebody who was older might be a little bit better yeah. to handle they're, uh, a chihuahua. Yeah, they're pretty good lap dogs. She's working on her leash skills. Oh. So I think she was carried around a little bit. Oh. So she's a little spoiled. <gasps> Honey, were you an accessory? That's okay. That's okay. I totally understand that. So, but she's just going to learn. Again, she's still a mm -hmm. baby. She's not even, you know, one yeah. year old. So that's good to remember, too. So what about, have you tested her with, um, I just love that sweater. It just kills me. <laughs> um, have you tested her around other dogs or perhaps cats um, yet? Cats, we really haven't. Mm -hmm. I'm sure she'll be fine. Other dogs. You can usually tell. Yeah, there's a chihuahua next door, and I think she really opens up when she sees them. Yeah. Probably because they're about the same size. Oh, yeah, she's right on your mic, so you might want to have her leave. Oh. There you go. <laughs> she was snuggling up to you, but you could just see she wants to snuggle. Mm -hmm. So, really, if you want to have a high contact dog, you know, this is and the they, dog. They really are, too. They, they're yeah. known for it, to mm -hmm. be very, very bonded to the family or to yes. the, the person. There you go. And she's pretty maintenance free being that size, gotta say. Mm -hmm. You know, you don't have to do the long hikes with this dog <laughs> unless you and want the, to put her in your backpack. The shedding is minimal, so. Yeah. Well, Bibi, we hope you find a loving home, sweetie. And I love it. She knows when you're talking to her. She just yep. looks right at you like, yes, I know. Uh, very quickly, if you would like to make Bibi a permanent part of your loving home, please just go right to our web channel, NBC15.com, and click on news links. Bibi, you're adorable. She's looking at me. Uh, Columbia County Humane Society, they are in Portage. This is a sweet dog who deserves a loving home. Hey, remember last week's Pet of the Week, Beethoven? This is very exciting. Beethoven was an 11-year-old black lab. It took a very special viewer who adopted Beethoven. So mm -hmm. Beethoven found a, a home. Now, on the younger and teenier scale, BB, let's go make it happen. Look at your sport in the sweater, you're getting into the spirit. Girl. She's ready to go today. Yeah, she's ready to go home today. So someone make it happen, and hopefully next week we'll have a great uh, update on BB. Thank you so much, Jennifer. Thank Happy you. Halloween to both of you. You too.